welcome back to my channel, The Foodie Gardener. I'm Becky, and on today's episode of Foodie Friday, we're going to talk about Hot Pot. Now you'll see as the video comes on, I don't have a set recipe like I typically do, because Hot Pot really doesn't have a set recipe. You don't measure out different portions and so forth and so on, you just kind of put in what you like. And you'll see as we talk about it, but here's a basic idea of what it looks like, and it's amazing. Hot Pot, or Shabu Shabu, is a social cooking method with deep roots in Asia. It is similar to fondue, but Hot Pot uses broth or water to cook instead of cheese or oil. Basically, you dip the food into simmering broth and let it cook. You can customize your menu with any fresh ingredients. When shopping for Hot Pot ingredients, I prefer to use my local international market. They offer a wider variety of options that you can't always find in your traditional grocery store. Some of my favorite must-haves are garlic, ginger, spring onions, Shanghai bok choy, just to name a few. Don't forget the fish balls, dumplings, and shrimp. Noodles are definitely a must. Hot Pot is not only a tasty dish, it's a communal experience to be shared with friends and family. So don't forget to pick up a tabletop unit, preferably one with two sides. Add a bit of broth and seasoning, and you're all set to go. If you use meat, be sure to get the thinly sliced meats so that they can cook a lot quicker. When trying Hot Pot, don't be shy. This gives you the opportunity to try new foods and play around with different seasonings. I'll add a few other options in the description box below. If you thought this video was helpful, go ahead and give it a thumbs up. And don't forget to subscribe so that you can catch more videos like this in the future. And as always, Here's wishing you great eats and happy gardening.